You see this, guys? You see how loose this is? Now, this can be tightened up through here on the bottom. So we're gonna go through the stage and see which, what needs to be tightened. I, I don't, so I'm gonna just grab a Allen key that fits here. And I'm just gonna do a couple turns. So that's pretty tight, so that's not it. So I'm gonna flip this back. Take your time with it. We're gonna go up in there with a 5 16th. And you don't wanna overdo it, over tighten it now. Just gonna fit it up in there. Hold this a little bit. And let's, let's check it. So it's still real loose. Let me hit that one more time. It's still really loose. So now we want to change this collar. We're going to go in there and change this collar. So to do that, we're going to knock this pin out. So you're just going to grab something that allows you to knock it out that's going to fit through there. So you can go either way. I'll probably come to the other side because this is further out, right? So I'm just coming here and just tap it. If you got someone to help you, have them hold it, but just slowly tap it. Or put it in a vice. Or you can put it in a vice, but this is, just tap it. Put that to the side somewhere. Then we're gonna take this off, okay? This should just come right off. Now you saw that there's some things that just fell, right? When you get that kit, you're gonna get a new one of these. So let's put that to the side. We gotta get this off. How do we get that off? What you gotta do, is you're gonna remove that, bo that bolt. That nut, that bolt. So, hold my hand over here. Pull it out. So everything looks, it's not broken. So probably the problem with this is you gotta replace the bearings. Those bearings look pretty good right there. So we're gonna keep those bearings at the bottom, but if you had to replace it, you, you have to remove this to pull this out. Um, bearings up here actually look pretty good. So, thing looks good there. So let's go ahead and put the new collar on it. So you'll just take this. Bring this back here. And then just screw this. Back down. 
All right, see that's not loose anymore. All right, so hey, they have done some changes to the to the GB120 um, TSA. Is they put these little, you can see over here, the locking washer over here. This is prevent that thing from coming out. So if you're repairing this this one, you got to take this off, and then you got to knock out that little sleeve. When you put this back together, put this on first before you do this before you put that bolt through there. So, but if you have any problems, it is a little bit, it's kind of a tricky one. You know, it's kind of hard for some people. Just go by your local dealer. There's a lot of local dealers, repair centers all over the country. You can check out goldentech.com, dealer information, put your zip code in there and you can find local dealers and you'll see if they're a, a repair center. Or you can give me a call at 803-926-2224. Also, if you're watching this video for some reason, you don't have this unit or you're fixing this for someone, carry on USA.com. We have the GB120s, we have the long range versions, and we have the new TSA versions. Give us a shot, give us a call. 803-926-2224.